MTC held the first public 5G technology trial demonstration, which is the fifth generation of wireless connectivity, allowing for faster and powerful connectivity that supports high-tech machines. For consumers, this means higher quality video and multimedia content can be delivered faster via increased capacity. While for businesses, this means potentials to transform performances and user experience beyond what is currently possible with existing network capabilities, including across mobile broadband, fixed wireless, and industrial applications such as the Internet of Things and Argumented Reality. We are not yet ready for the commercial rollout plans. I am happy to indicate to you our esteemed guests that this morning's event is about the demonstration of 5G and the blissful opportunities it can present to a digitally-led economy. We wish to make it known that today's event is not a commercial launch of 5G services in Namibia by MTC. The managing director of Huawei Namibia, Michael Zhang, vowed Huawei's commitment to work closely with MTC to deploy cutting-edge technologies to ensure fast and high-quality 5G deployments. It will become a fundamental change for our lifestyle. Like you just saw in the video, you may not feel this now, but 5G will change our life, will change uh, our economic growth, it will enhance our productivity and improve the quality of life for all the people in Namibia. But this is not only MTC uh, and Huawei's work to do it. Uh, I, it, re it requires everybody here to be uh, a very innovative and dare to try something new. On her part, the Minister of Information and Communication Technology noted that the opportunities that come with 5G are vast and it's upon Namibians to ensure that they take full leverage of it. Actually, investing in the technology becomes a, a hustle and a debate. But unfortunately, technology is expensive, possibly expensive in the short term, but definitely the long-term benefits outweigh that investment. And yes, as a government, we want to bridge the digital divide and the digital gap. Many Dear fellows added that, Compared to peers in the region, Namibia has lagged behind in adopting 5G technology because of conspiracy theories. At the beginning of 2021, we were ready to allow the mobile operators to launch 5G in Namibia. In fact, we were planning to be the first to do so in the southern region, just like we did with 3G and 4G before it some years ago. However, alas, due to conspiracy theories, around COVID-19, where some of our citizens believe that 5G would cause COVID-19, were able to put all of that aside, do an investigation to prove that 5G does not cause COVID-19. If 5G is implemented in Namibia, it can be used to fuel smart agriculture, mining and manufacturing drive telemedicine and e-health, and improve e-governance and e-commerce, among others. Julana Fuka, NBC News, Bantuk.